Hello everyone, welcome back to High Tech Builds of YouTube channel. In today's video, we'll be exploring about the barcode labels and uncovering their uses and advantages in streamlining business operations. So let us discuss what are barcode labels. So barcode labels are a graphical representation of data that can be scanned and read by barcode scanners or smartphone equipped with barcode scanning apps. Actually, barcodes are surprisingly very inexpensive to design and print off. Also, they are extremely versatile, so they can be used for all kind of data collection. Uh, now, let us discuss what are the advantages or what are the benefits of using a barcode labels in your business. So, barcode labels are greatly enhanced point of sale efficiency. By using barcode labels on your product, the checkout process become more faster and more accurate as scanning the barcode speed up the process, reduces the human error and ensures smooth transaction. They automate stock control, reduce manual error and enable accurate inventory tracking from receiving to shipping. This results in improved efficiency and reduced cost. Okay, now let's take a closer look like how to create a barcode label in high-tech billing software. First of all, we have to make a quick printer setting before generating a barcode label. For that, you can simply go to the setting option in the software. Here in general, you can see a inventory identifier option. In this, we can see here is a drop down. From here, you can select the barcode option. So this is our first setting. Then again, in the setting tab only, you can see here is a printing option. You can go here. Now in the general configuration, we have an option of barcode printing engine. Then we have to select the first option from here as we are creating a barcode label on E4 document. So we have to select the first option from the drop down. And if you'll be creating in it POS, so you can choose accordingly from the second and third option. Then in the header only, there is a last option of default printer. You have to tap on that option. Now here is two barcode printing option. The very first is for barcode printing A4 and the second one is for POS. So we have to select it from the first option like barcode printing A4 is here. You have to select the barcode printing printers from the drop down. All right. So all the basic setting has been done. Now let us see how to create a barcode label. So there are the three possible ways to generate a barcode label in the software. Firstly, you can create it from the tools option. Secondly, you can create it from the master tab. And the last one is from the purchase bell. Let us see step by step how it can be done. Okay, so firstly go to the tools option in the software. Now here we can see a barcode generator. We have to tap on this option. So this is a tab which will be going to appear on your screen. The very first option is template type. You can select a template type. I mean the label from the drop down. Uh, here are the types of labels given. You can choose accordingly from here. The second option we see here is a start position. You can type it up here manually like right now I am assuming that I am putting here fun. So the barcode sticker or the barcode labels which we are creating will be going to start from the first line in a single page in which we are generating or printing our barcode stickers. Now you can see here are the two checkbox. The first one says unique and the second one says auto save. If the barcode stickers which we are creating for a particular product you want it to be a unique and different from each other so you can just right click the checkbox and the next option is auto saves it says if the barcode label which we are creating you want it to get saved on your system or on the software so you can simply right click on the checkbox the next option we see here is a manage template you can tap on this option if you want to make a changes or if you want to edit the barcode setting so you can do it over here all right now the next option we see here is a product name you can just type the initial of product name from here so it will automatically fetch the product details so i am searching my product from here okay 
other details has been filled automatically okay okay so the next option is number of labels you have to type here manually like how many stickers you want to create or how many labels of that products you want to create for right now i am putting it as 10 like right now i want to uh, generate a 10 barcode sticker for this product here is a header option if you want to put any header for that particular product so it will be going to display on that barcode stickers so you can mention it over here the next option we see here is a line 1 and line 2 if you want to add any information about that product so you can type it up here in a box so it will be going to display in your barcode stickers as well okay now you see here is a plus icon on the right side you have to tap on that icon to add the details okay now we can see here on the left bottom it is showing like it will take a one single paper to generate this barcode stickers and after entering all the details you have to tap on the generate option just after clicking on the generate option you can see here is the preview of all the generated barcode labels which we have created right away you can see here is a printer icon on the left side if you want to save a pdf copy of the barcode label you can select the destination from here and you can save it as a pdf so in this way we can generate a barcode labels from the tools barcode generator option now let us see the second option from where you can generate the barcode sticker for that you can simply go to the master option in the software and there you can have to tap on the search and manage item option now in the right bottom you can see here is an option of barcode a4 you have to tap on that option this is a tab which will be going to appear on your screen so you have to fill the details over here and you can generate the barcode sticker from here also like you can enter all the details like the template type you can select from here you can put the starting position you can enable the two checkbox unique and auto save from here the manage template is here you can customize the details for the barcode stickers then you can select the product name you can set the number of stickers i.e number of labels in the box then you have to enter other details as well after that you have to click on this plus icon if you want to add or if you want to create a barcode label for one or more product so you can select the second product in the same way as well from here then after filling all the details you can see on the left side it is mentioned you need one page for printing all the barcode label it has calculated the overall sticker of both the products now i have to click on this generate option for generating the barcode label okay so this is the perfect print preview as you can see all the barcode stickers are generated for both the product as well now i can take the print over here or i can see the pdf of this barcode stickers in my system okay now let's see the last option for creating a barcode stickers through a purchase bill so you can simply go to the purchase option in the software then new purchase bill you can add a purchase bill from here so let me assume that uh, I am creating a purchase bill in with the product type. I am selecting a GST. Then I can say put the purchase date from here. I can choose the supplier name from here. In the same way, we can add my payment terms and due date from here. We can choose a place of supply from here. If you want to add any purchase bill number or purchase order number, you can type it up here in a box then the next option is purchase order date and eway bill number so you can put it up from here now for fetching a product details here are the two options either you can fetch to item tag or item code or you can choose the item name box like i'm typing the initial of my product name so it has automatically filled the order details so if you want to add any item description for that particular product you can type it up here in a box after then here is a plus icon we have to tap on that plus icon to add the product into that bill okay so my product has been added if you want to put any discount or shipping charges you can enable this checkbox and you can type it up here if you want to put a tcs you can also put it from here now we can put the remarks and amount from here so all the detail has been filled now we can save it or we can save and print it right now we are saving this purchase bill so i am clicking on the save icon okay now we can see just after saving this bill we can see here is a barcode option 
uh, this icon has been unfreezed now just after tapping on this icon here comes a tab for generating a barcode stickers in the same way we can put the details over here like we can select the template type we can put the starting position and we can manually put the product name we can put the labels in the same way we can fill all the details that we have filled previously and just after entering all the details we have to tap on this generate icon and you have to confirm this pop-up and looks uh, here your barcode sticker has been generated you can also save it by tapping on this printer icon in your system so this is the way like how we can create a barcode table stickers in our high-tech billing software hope you like the video if you like the video be sure to give a thumbs up the subscribe button for upcoming videos and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss a video thank you for watching this video stay connected with high tech billing software